Hello, Vaya. How are you today? Hello, I'm fine. I'm really happy that I'm again here in Aplios. Uh, what about you? How are you? I'm fine. I'm enjoying the weather today in uh, Gristia show. <laughs> it's uh, very unusual for this uh, April, no? Yeah. It's a little it's bit really warm day, yeah. yeah than, than normal, but yeah. it's nice. So, you are the chief stew here in uh, Daloli, yes. Motoria Daloli. Yeah. Uh, tell me something about uh, your job. Uh, what are you doing every day here on board? Okay, when we have guests, yes. Uh, usually I woke up around two hours before them. I have to prepare all the yacht just to be clean and tidy. Then I have to prepare the table for the breakfast for them. Usually you serve it in the aft deck uh, or inside, depends the weather. Um, the breakfast is most of the time um, on the aft deck. deck, yes. Uh, it's nice. It's yeah, nice, it's nice to view to, because to, stay there to enjoy the view, the, the yes. pressure from the morning, yeah. drinking uh, fresh juice. <laughs> of course, because you know we're sleeping in the port at night, but yes. uh, we woke up really early and then we go somewhere beautiful just for them to eat their breakfast quiet and with beautiful view. And then I prepare the, the table usually outside there for the breakfast. For the breakfast. Then they need maybe some cocktails. Uh, I'm around with them out there all the time. They're swimming. If they need something, yeah. if they ask for something yeah. just to be there, to be sure you want yeah. to make them happy. Of course. <laughs> you know, your job is just to make them happy. And it's all about how you make people feel. Of course. Is that simple? Is that hard? <laughs> it's a vacation for them and uh, they you yeah. want them to make them happy to enjoy the of course the, the cruise and my goal is the mm, just to have great time uh, I hope they're gonna come back again next year and I just want to see them happy of course whatever they want normal things okay yes. <laughs> of course. <laughs> How many stew are this uh, are you on board here? We are two. You are two. The you yeah. the chief stew and another stewardess. Yeah. And uh, what you prepare for the lunch? How you prepare the table for the dinner? Okay. Yeah. Every day I want to show them something different because they are eat at the same place. I mean on board. And then uh, I want to show them something different every day. Maybe I collect the shells or I grab a map from the bridge and I make like sheep or something like that uh, with ropes or with flowers. So every day actually you make a new design to yeah. not make them boring, to yeah. make them surprised of course. and impress them, yeah. of course. With shiny colors every day. You know, I just want to impress them and to see something different every day. So you must be creative a little of bit. Of course. Uh, thanks God that I am. <laughs> I just grab a rope or stones and I make something beautiful, as they said, and I'm happy for that. If they come from them inside, see, that means it's like that. Yeah. <laughs> um, and you serve them coffees, cocktails. Yeah. Um, uh, usually uh, before the lunch, we, they are sitting uh, up there to the sand deck, make for them some cocktail music, or maybe if they don't want alcohol, maybe just water with strawberries and uh, lemon, something like that. Um, at night, we have party on Sunday sometimes with cocktails or soft drinks or what they like, or live music sometimes we have so on you board. make parties? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, uh, I'm curious how you, how did you start this job? Because it's not an usual job in the office on the land. Of course. Uh, how, it, from where it was starting? It was idea, really something very... Unexpected. One. Yeah. <laughs> my, my brother, yes. uh, he's a chef. Ah. many years on yacht and he asked me do you want I said no do you want I said no and one day he said do you want to try I was in a holidays and he said okay just Why for it yeah just for a <laughs> charter and I said but hey just for a charter because maybe I don't like it and he said yes just for a charter and then I really love it because I love to traveling and my free time I traveling a lot maybe two or three um, uh, trips on a year yes and uh, 
from the first charter, I said, okay, I love this job. <laughs> because I like to make people smiling, I like to travel, I like to meet new people and new cultures, you know. So you enjoy very much your, your job? Yeah. Do you know what I think? If you don't love this job and you do it just for the money, you cannot do it good. Because you have to work maybe 18 or 20 hours per day and if you don't really love it, you cannot do it good. And if you cannot do it good, you can do it maybe for a year because the sea put the garbage out by herself. Of course. I think. Uh, since how many years do you do this job? Five years. Five years already? Yeah. And for example, next year or in five years, you still uh, think that you are going to work as a... I don't year? know what is going to be tomorrow. <laughs> I don't have an answer for that. <laughs> you just enjoy the moment. Yeah. The benefits of this beautiful job, yeah. traveling for free all around the world. Yeah. Very nice salary. And also uh, when it's coming the tips uh, after one week, two weeks, depends how, for That's how also long really they uh, yeah. uh, enjoy that. Um, if you can tell us a little bit of the secrets. <laughs> mm. What do you mean the secrets? I mean, uh, for example, how uh, in the past, for example, for one week, how much you get tips uh, for one week? It depends. Maybe a thousand. Yes. Maybe just 300. Depends of the client. Depends of the client. Yeah. So your salary is... Uh, it's very good. It's very good. I'm happy for my salary. What I ask for, this is what I get. Yes. And that's good. I can I ask you how much you have the salary? Um, Around, more or less? Around 2,000. Around 2,000. Yeah. Okay, that's good. And the tips is also good here. So after one season, you are happy? Yeah. Also during the season, I'm happy. I like what I'm doing. That's this why... This is the most important. Yeah. To like. We can go uh, in the master cabin. Of course. So you can uh, explain me also beside the service that you are doing every day, what you do also in the cabins. I do nothing in the cabins usually uh, because she's doing it, but I know, <laughs> yes. Okay, we are here now in the master cabin of the boat, of this beautiful boat. It's like a hotel, but more Yes, we have to pay attention more to details, you know, because there is no hotel that costs so many money for the night. And also here I try to make something different every night, like when we're going to the port, I just bought two or three capostal from the island, or just the flowers, or just the cookies, or something sweet for the night, or I don't know so what I'm... All the time you impressed your guests, actually. Yeah, yeah. I, I like <laughs> that. Yeah. yeah. Or yeah. just a small present. Very much when, when they see every day the room uh, in different ways. Yeah. Because you are going in the hotel uh, and you see your room uh, all the time the same. Yes. I don't want something like Because, you know, and all, the most of the yachts, they just put uh, the linen and all this stuff and the bed is tidy. But, okay, I want to give something more. Yes, and here the cleanest is very important. Uh, of you, course. E or every day you clean the room, every day you clean the bathrooms. and um, More than the three times in the day. Exactly. Yeah. So it depends on the guests. Yeah. You want to pamper your guests to make them feel happy and of comfortable course. as of well. Of course. We, we fix the cabins once uh, after the breakfast yes. and then before the dinner or after, depends on the time. And during the day, we came down just check everything just to be okay fix the pillows a bit or the toilet in the afternoon you do the turn beds uh, the turn yeah. turning beds yeah before them to sleep you of turn course the yeah yeah we turn it like yeah. yeah so you prepare them for for sleep or of course when they come from the party to have the bed very nice yeah. tidy. <laughs> of course <laughs> just a little bit light just to be more you atmosphere down to yeah. make them a romantic atmosphere. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, your colleague, uh, what, is, what is her duties? What she, she is doing on board beside you? Because you are a supervisor as well. Of course. Uh, she's doing um, the most of the time the cleaning of the cabins. Just I'm here with her. Yes. Because I like to help her. We are like team. Of 
course. Uh, she's doing also the laundry by herself. Yes. Um, for the crew and for the guests as well. Yes, of course. And you know, we have a plan and we're doing all the things like team and together you know I help her to the cabins and she's helping me to the service because I think we are just two there is not a so big boy like 15 I, I think the most important here in a one boat in one motor boat you must be like a family of course because it's like only few crew for example how many are we are eight eight crews so and if you don't uh, understand each, each other, other if you don't uh, like each other it's, it's difficult and that's why you need to help each other in of the course. end to make the, the, the people the, who charter the boat uh, to make them happy. Of because if you are not happy and you if you don't have a good smile then they are not happy. Of and we are together more than we are our, with our families. 24-7 we are at the same small place. We have to be like a team of and course. we have to help each other. Of course. Otherwise it's not working uh, very well. Exactly. And, and the most important in the end if you make your clients happy they leave you more tips of course <laughs> <laughs> and this is actually it's uh, one of your, the goal <laughs> one of the goal your responsibility more or less you are the responsibility of the chef of the captain of the staff captain the engineer the deck of course. so you that's why you need to work all together very nice yeah. um, when you don't have charters what you what you do you prepare for the next charter uh, yes because we usually we don't have so many days gap just maybe one or three usually you have one week charter for uh, the guests one week or ten days depends uh, depends and then maybe we have one or three days gap yes and then the next charter come and then we have just to clean the boat we really really clean and tidy uh, have provision for the next charter and we just uh, I'm just thinking what difference can I do now something like that we don't have so many days gap we don't have oh, but it's good because in short time you receive a lot of money yeah uh, before the charters and after the charters you have much more time uh, to spend in the port to visit the town of course every place you go every island you go so you have something uh, the your personal time as well of course and when the guests uh, they go out for the dinner maybe and the boat is like tidy and clean we can go out visit the island also have a bit of free time just to Sometimes they take you away with you yeah. when you go in the restaurant. Many times. They make you present yeah. like that to, yeah. to disconnect a little yeah. bit from the job, to be more like a family all together, the crew. Yeah, it happened the, many times. No, it does uh, nice. Maybe they want me to swim with them or to go out for shopping with them or with for dinner with them. So you have a, like a vacation yeah. uh, job <laughs> yeah. sometimes. Sometimes. <laughs> it's not so often, but it happens. Because you, yeah. all, are, uh, you all are also paid to to, to yeah. go with them to for swimming to and uh, of course, course you, you enjoy it yeah in which language you speak with them you speak in English I speak English and I speak uh, German basic German basic and yeah. also Greek because oh, yeah, you of are course. from Greece yeah okay uh, nice to meet you nice to meet you too <laughs> beautiful you, eyes thank you <laughs> I hope you enjoy this uh, this summer here in Greece thank you very much and uh, I hope you have a uh, prosperity guests and uh, to meet you also next year Thank from the you. boat show. <laughs> I wish you the best. <laughs> Thank you.